Wrestling fans around the corner, around the world, I'm Dan Marotti. And I'm John Cena Sr. Johnny, the fans just haven't asked for it, they have demanded it. This August, we're headed back to Tampa for Russell House 2. WrestleMania weekend, we brought you Sinister Minister James Mitchell, TJP, Demolition Smash, Al Snow, Dutch Mantel Zeb Coulter, JTG of Crime Time, and WWE Hall of Famer Gerald Briscoe for in-depth interviews and live interactive cyber autograph signings. And if you want our Wednesday Night Wrestling Insider Special edition episodes to continue, we need your help to bring these superstars careers and lives to life. Bringing you free content seven days each week is an expensive proposition between appearance fees, air travel, renting the house, the equipment and everything that goes in to a week of shooting. We can't do it without you. As we prepare to return to producing live and ring events, help us bring you the superstars and legends of yesterday and tomorrow by visiting Indiegogo now and check out some of the great rewards. Wrestling fans, it's going to be a wild week in Tampa the first week in August. Get ready for Wrestle House 2. Um, I think that's horrible, and I think it's hysterical at the same time. <laughs> now, what about Jerry Jarrett, though? That was who I originally brought up. Did you like Jerry as a promoter, or was he honest with you? Did he treat you right? He was cool with me. Mm -hmm. Never had a problem with it. Jeff, on the other hand, I didn't like. Now, why is that? We did a show one night when I was the USWA. And just said, Jack, you got tonight off. It was a tag match. Mm -hmm. He said, Mark Freer is going to do the whole match. You just stand on the side of the ring and cheerlead. I said, we're a tag team. He said, I know. He said, but we give you the night off. And Mark did the whole match. I didn't come in one time. I go to ECW. I started using the guitar. Jeff Jarrett, all of a sudden, started using a fucking guitar. I said, I wonder where that came from. Do you think that Jeff didn't like you? Did he not like the reaction that you were getting from the fans where you were over? What do you think? No, I was over, and he, he didn't like the fact that I was over. That was the problem. He is in my book. Oh, he really? Put, he puts me over in my book. He put you over? Yeah. You got a quote from him? It's in there. Enter, oh, I, I can't Buy the book. read it. <laughs> oh, it's open for a comp, brother. Come on now. <laughs> but no, I really am anxious to read it. So you and Jeff, whatever the issue was back in USWA, and then him kind of hustling your gimmick from ECW, you guys are cool now? If I saw him, I'd speak to him. That's the extent of it. Yeah. Yeah. I wouldn't give him a glass of water if he was starving. But fucking, he'd be dying of thirst. I would give him a glass of water. But you'd say hello to him at least. Yeah, I speak hey, motherfucker. You want some water? <laughs> oh my god, this is hysterical. <laughs> but um, was the money as bad as everybody said? In USWA? Yeah. Fifty dollars a night. Wow. How many shots a week? Four. Wow, two hundred bucks a week. Jesus. Now, how did you survive on $200 a week? I had a Fiero. Remember the little car? Yeah. I was sleeping in my car. Wow. Then, all of a sudden, somebody turned me on to ring rats. <laughs> and I was like, I think I could swing this. So every time I would go out to a bar or go to a club, 
The World Wrestling Federation was live in El Paso, Texas, Sunday, July the 13th, 1997. In the opening contest, Bob Hawley beat Leaf Cassidy. The Godwins with the win over the Headbangers. Rockabilly defeated Flash Funk. Brian Pillman victorious over Jesse James. DOA beat the New Blackjacks. Ken Shamrock with the win over WWF European champion, the British Bulldog Davey Boy Smith via disqualification. Goldust defeated Hunter Hearst Helmsley. Stone Cold Steve Austin and Mankind victorious over Brett Hitman Hart and WWF Intercontinental Champion Owen Hart. And in the main event, WWF World Champion The Undertaker retained the title over Vader in a casket match. If you were in El Paso Live, share your memories in the comment section below. Use the links in the description box to keep wrestling legends working in our eBay store and on our world-renowned Patreon streaming service so we can bring you more interactive superstar shoot interviews to relive the good old days of professional wrestling. Check it out. Boston Wrestling Sports and the MWF explodes into a new year with professional wrestling content galore and need you to join our family. Every Tuesday night at 10 p.m. after our Monday Night Raw review, it's Wrestling Inside Us at your house with WWE Hall of Famer Mr. USA Tony Atlas. Wednesday nights at 10 p.m. after NXT and AEW, join rotating legends on Wrestling Inside Us Special Edition. Every Thursday night at 10 p.m. after our NXT and Dynamite review, it's Marty Jannetty's No Holds Barred Sex, Drugs, and Rock and Roll Journey on Wrestling Insiders Party with Marty. Friday night after SmackDown, don't miss John Cena Sr.'s Wrestling Insiders Fabulous Fridays. Plus, look for classic clips, history videos, bonus live episodes, pay-per-view watch-alongs, and more. For less than a cup of coffee at Starbucks, get early ad-free access to our Wrestling Insider talk shows, our acclaimed studio shoot interview DVD library, and help keep wrestling legends working during the worst of times